Hello there. This is a teaser build for PrintShift 4.0 in which I try to make PrintShift easier to build. For folks that don't know, PrintShift is a part ejection system for a Prusa Mini, so far, that's as easy to install as I can make it and leaves your excellent Prusa Mini as unmodified as I can make it. The idea is to turn your Prusa Mini into an automated, unintended 3D printing factory. The project is fully open source, parts are up on GitHub, and it's supported by Patreons on Patreon. Currently scrolling by below, Thank you all very much. Links in the description. This video is a time lapse of putting together the first complete 4.0 printer, and the first step is still building the Prusa Mini and using it to print out your print shift parts. So what's new in 4.0? No more messing with the Prusa's electronics. Unless you feel like stealing power from there. Print shift 4.0 runs off of 5 volts, so you can use an external 5 volt power supply for both the Pi and the print shift ejection motor. Along with that, we have a lot fewer parts. Print shift 4.0 is much easier and cheaper to build. To make room for the conveyor belt, we're lifting the bed 6mm, so replacing Prusa's 4mm standoffs with 10mm ones. The belt is tensioned on the right side and driven on the left. The space is a bit tight, but again new for 4.0, the motor is directly attached. And yes, I've tested the bed moving with all the additional weight. There's no skip steps until you crank the speed way up, roughly twice as fast as Prusa's stock printing speeds. You really don't need extra print speed when you have a machine that can run 24 hours a day. Instead of only printing while you're awake to hit the print button, now you can actually print over and over again. The total time elapsed over the course of this video build is about two hours, and yes, I'm a rather experienced builder and quite familiar with how the parts I design are supposed to be attached, but still a huge improvement. There's still a final step I'll take on this machine, and that's attaching a Raspberry Pi running Octoprint, as well as a camera attached to the Pi. However, you'll notice that the ejector works entirely in G-code. This Print Shift Prusa Mini is printing from a USB stick. The Pi is very convenient and adds a ton of features, but even now this Mini has become a factory. Like and subscribe for updates and a detailed build series on PrintShift 4.0, and please consider supporting the project on Patreon as I work on scaling PrintShift up to larger printers. Happy printing!